very nice looks. Mm. Sounds good. Good for eating. What's the name of the tree? Um, Capea capensis. Capea capensis. That's a scientific name. Yeah, but uh, the English is just Capea. Ah, Capea. Maasai giraffe in Olare Motorogi. Living on the Capea tree. Capea tree. So they eat uh, uh, constantly all day, huh? Yeah. Um, they can rest when they're done, but when they rest, they can even lie down and chew. You know, they chew like what the buffaloes are doing. They chew cuds. Yeah. Actually, you know what? The giraffe is the largest of the ruminants uh -huh. and the tallest of the mammals. Ah, uh, okay. It's the Guinness Book of Records for being the tallest mammal, because the, the the biggest one, the Maasai, is actually the tallest. The female like this can be around 19 feet, mm. and, the, and the male can be up to 20 feet. Mm. That's like 5.5 wow. meters, and the, this girl can be up to like 5 meters mm. high. That's how wow. what they do when when lion is coming. You know, they fly high when making that sound. Yeah. So they, they help each other. You know, they feed on the giraffe's um, ticks, the ticks that invade the giraffes. Yeah. And also they become the alarm. Mm. You know, they make them a lot. I see. It's called symbiotic relationship. Symbiotic, yeah, yeah. I help you, you help me. Scratch my back, I scratch your back. I have a fly in my ear. Oh, so yeah. I'm helping the fly, but the fly doesn't help me at all. Yeah, that is not, that is not symbiosis. Yeah. Yeah, that is uh, it's almost parasitic. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's almost parasitizing you. Yes. But I'm hold, I'm trying to hold this cam uh, video steady. I got it. And you know, once I'm done, yep. this fly, this fly is not going to live much longer, <laughs> <laughs> or it won't be in my ear for much longer. I got it. Maasai giraffe in the Olar Mara Orla Olare Motorogi Conservancy. There is actually more than what you see in the video, but. I don't want to move the video as much. Ten. There are ten on this side and much more on the other side. Yep. A journey of giraffes or a tower of giraffes. That's a, that's, that's a um, woodpecker. The one making the sound. Oh, yeah. It's a Nubian woodpecker, woodpecker with a red in the, in the head. Mm hmm. Bright red colors in the red head. That's it. These giraffe are very relaxed around us. And there's a guy in the group that is in his. Yeah. He doesn't tolerate any other males around. So usually they have they establish what we call hierarchies. So they know each other, they know who is strongest, and that's how they keep. Uh, that's how that's how they um, eventually. How they nature make sure that the strongest of, of of the males will pass on the genes.